The Lions and Leo Clubs of Tortola, in partnership with the BVI Christian Council, marked the 35th lighting of the Christmas tree at the Sir Alva George's Plaza in Roadtown on November 29th. President of the Lions Club of Tortola, Hesket Newton, used the occasion to call on fellow Lions, Leos and the wider community to be the solution they wish to see in their community. This approach, he says, is needed to address the scourge of crime and other social ills in the Virgin Islands. We are all aware of the increasing challenges in our community and we need to do what we can as members of the Lions family to help bring about comfort and support to those in need. Obesity, diabetes, cancer and domestic violence are becoming more prevalent in our society. Educating the youth and all the like about these diseases has become a necessity. The youth are not re respecting their elders and there is no other time than now for us to be our brothers and sisters keeper. The world is suffering from high commodity prices and our community is not immune to these economic influences. Therefore, we are left to find creative solutions to provide a comfortable life for ourselves and for those who are dependent on us, family, the less fortunate, and the community. As we reflect on the air that will soon pass and approach the new year, let us ponder on what we can do as a club to continue to make a difference in the lives of the less fortunate in our community. As Gandhi said, you must be the change you want to see in the world. Canon Ronald Branch of the St. George's Episcopal Church, BVI, says while many people make room for new things in their homes around Christmas time, similarly, we should also unclutter our sinful hearts and seek God's forgiveness. We make room for new things. But just as we do so to our homes, we are called to do so with our hearts. We are called to unclutter our sinful hearts, to seek God's forgiveness because Advent is a penitential season. And to understand that this God who is a forgiving God is willing to forgive us our sins. For he has said to us in many ways that if we come to him and seek his forgiveness, he shall separate our sins from us as far as the east is from the west. Fourth District Representative Mark Vantepool in his remarks commended the Lions Club of Tortola for its service over the past 35 years. He also called on residents to be compassionate with people in the territory and beyond who are less fortunate or faced with oppressed living conditions. Christmas is a time when we try to encourage everyone to reflect all over the world as to the spirit of what Christmas is and what Christ brought to us, peace and good tidings into the world. But yet we know across the world there are many who are suffering, many who are having hard times, many who are in conflict, many who are in poverty, many who are suffering diseases and illnesses that are deadly. And we want us all at this time when Christ brought peace and good tidings and new life to us to remember those across the world in places like Syria where many children can't run around like the ones we see here tonight in peace. In Iraq, in Lebanon, in Palestine and many other places across the world even right here close to us in the city of Ferguson and St. Louis and other places where there is strife and conflict. Let us in our prayers, let us in our reflections at this Christmas time, remember them. 
But let us also remember those who live among us, those who are having difficult times, those who at times can't make ends meet, those who may have a little difficulty having a meal for the next day. We want to remember them at this Christmas time and reach out our hands to help at this time when we as a community, in our own tradition that we have always had, live together, remember our neighbors, and at Christmas time, we sing the carols together, we serenade, and we share what we have with our neighbors, and we want us to continue that good tradition. The 35th lighting of the Christmas tree event also featured solo and group performances from various local entertainers. You can see the entire event speeches and performances as well as the lighting of the Christmas tree right here on JTV Channel 55. 